Ugh, there we go. Cool. Games. <clears throat> Are you ready, kids? Aye, aye, Captain! I can hear you! Aye, aye, Captain! Who... Who lives in a pineapple under the sea? This mic. Okay. I'm actually excited for this game. This game I've never played. Um, I had my my cousin play it. Welcome to I, Bikini Bottom, to a normally peaceful undersea sanctuary. Today it will be transformed into a theater of pure horror, wherein our little yellow friend will play the starring role. Today is the big day. I have devised an ingenious plan to finally steal the Krabby Patty formula. And if Bikini Bottom happens to get demolished in the process, oh well. <laughs> With my brand new Duplicatotron 3000, I'll clone an army of robots that will wreak mayhem and destruction at my command. One last review of the checklist. Let's see. Item number one, is Plankton a genius? Answer, yes! Okay, checklist complete. Throw in the switch! <laughs> Welcome, my perfectly obedient robot army! Hang on, I want to get a photo for my scrap... Oh, hey, hello? What do you think you're doing? Oh, no, 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 wait! But I'm your master! I made you! No! No! Oh, my good China! Another perfect day playing robots and racehorses. Yeah, only I keep getting the racehorses and the robots mixed up. Wouldn't it be great if we had real robots to play with, Patrick? I'd name mine Robo Jr. or Zorlon or maybe Frankie. Yeah, these unreal robots are getting boring. Hey, what if we put the robots in here? Oh, how shellfish of you. <laughs> it's not just any shell. It's my magic wishing shell. Wow, that's great, Patrick. So we put the toy robots in here. Okay. Then we say the magic wishing words and shake the magic wishing shell. Okay. Then we go to sleep, and in the morning, we'll have real robots to play with. But Patrick, aren't we going to say the magic wishing words? You already did. So okay is the magic wishing word? It used to be Alakazama Alabala Wisna Tikitana Fushbar Griddle Bits Von Wiedeschnasser, but I kept forgetting it. Are you sure this will work? Sure. Last week, I only had one big cookie crumb and I was really hungry. So I put my cookie crumb in the magic wishing shell, then I said the magic wishing word and shook it, and in the morning, I had lots of little cookie crumbs. Patrick, I proclaim that tomorrow is going to be the best day ever. Good night, SpongeBob. Good night, Patrick. The next morning. 
gonna play with robots, gonna play with robots, gonna play with robots, gonna play with... Whoa! Uh, Gary, did you do that? Yeah, Gary. It sure looks like we're in a doozy of a pickle. I think I'm gonna have to learn a lot in order to fix this mess. What a fantastic idea! These signs will provide important tips to help me out. Um, how do I read the signs? Oh, okay. Press this button to read the signs. Hmm. So if I want to come back and talk to you again, just walk up to you and press this button. I'd better get started now, Gary. I think that this is going to be a very long day. Explore the rest of Andra's house. Cool! Alright. Uh, Alright. Wow. Give me some credit, Gary. I remember. Press this button to read the signs. Hmm. Breaking news! Bikini Bottom residents have been attacked by a raging torrent of robot horror! So much for fixing this quietly. <laughs> Authorities are not sure who is responsible for unleashing the mechanical menaces, but they have assured us that the person is in big, big trouble! Uh-oh. Did I say big trouble? I meant so enormous that it's hard to comprehend trouble! We'll keep you posted as this tragic story unfolds! Tragically, we're sure. You only need to find one golden spatula. Okay, cool. Ah, oh, the camera's... Oh, no, I'll get used to it. I need... Wow. Give me oh. some... These are shiny eyes. Shiny objects are valuable to be retreated to help SpongeBob with his quest. When you collect many shiny in order to complete his quest to defeat the robot menace, there are five different colors. Red, yellow, blue. Red is the most common and the least valuable. Purple is the most rare and therefore the most valuable. More valuable shiny are usually harder to find or in more dangerous places. Cool. Okay, we already got that. Alright. Yeah, this is a game that I've always wanted. Well, actually, to be honest, as a kid, I never it's wanted to snack. Never really caught my interest. But. Well, actually, it did. I don't know what I'm saying. Yeah, I've always wanted to play this game. It's just I never got a chance to. And then when I heard that the remaster was coming out, I thought, <laughs> you know what? I need to play this game. I need to prepare myself for what's coming. The controls are moving to the right to rotate. Left to move up and down. Press the egg when you are done. Okay, that's 50. <laughs> this is about going earlier to unlock the Maria as you walk. Spongebob may collect many gold in order to find and defeat the source of the vampire robots. Okay, look at that. Nice. Okay. Alright, let's see if there's anything else in here. Oh yeah, I can go here. The store is locked. Do we need to find... Oh, I didn't get them all. Okay. I know you can leave, but I kind of just want to get everything. Oh, okay, there we go. There we go. Okay. I don't know when the remaster is coming out, but I just want to prepare myself. I mean, the game itself is pretty easy. Honestly, it's... Wait, to enter... Maybe a little bounce on the old... This is a pair of us... This is a pair of every time he gets hit by a robot or touches dangerous objects on the surface. Oh, like that. <laughs> Once Spongebob has lost all his armor, he must start that area over yet. Spongebob may get back. He has lost my collective digital pairs along the way. Spongebob started by wearing three pairs of armor. 
You're special, there's a golden one right there. You're allowed to buy one well, more than three today. How many pairs he has on my present? Oh, I'm sorry. Um, I feel like a new sponge. I'm a little tired right now. I'm gonna jump my present with the grand boss. Cause him to double print, but can only double him once per jump. Yeah, I want it by pressing the right There's no one should have shown up. Okay. Okay. There's a lot of them in here. Press the uh, button will do a double bull spin. Use it to smash open tiki's. Push buttons to defeat most robots. You may also use bow spin and mid jump to hit things that are higher up. Okay, let's continue on. It may to the bow do a bubble bounce attack. But I drag them below. Or push buttons on the seven. I do. Okay. Press the A on the ground and it will do a bubble bash attack. The bubble bash will smash diggies or robots that are directly above. When you see a Zygon, you do it to break diggies directly above. And any more. Oh god. To see how well this did every level, they get press start and then. Blah blah blah. Blah blah blah. SpongeBob, I hit the beach. I need Spatcha, that's what it knows about, but pressing it when the hint for going to slip, Spongebob can take a time to the air of that Spatcha, but oh, that's actually really cool. Okay, let's test this out. I don't know what that is for. There we go. It shines. Pow! Sometimes pushing a simple button is the most satisfying. Push, 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 push. So this is just like the little heel stuff. Where's the ball, by the way? Oh, there we go. Oh, come on. Oh, God. I'm crap. Alright, let's start the game, hopefully. Okay. It's a fun game. I feel like I could beat... I, I kind of think about it. I'm done with my finals, by the way. Today ah, was the last day. There was nothing like the sounds of your own neighborhood. Go away, SpongeBob. You're polluting my thinking space. Trying to steal the Krabby Patty formula again, eh, Plankton? Well, you won't get away with it! I've got bigger fish to fry! I've got to figure out how to regain control of the chum bucket from those robots! Where did they come from? Where? Um, I don't know. Not for me, though, that's for sure. 
They just showed up out of nowhere and started calling me rude names and throwing things. They even bent all my spoons. I love those spoons like they were my children. That's terrible. Oh, won't you help me stop them? Before they bend all my forks? Not the forks! Of course I'll help. But wait, I'm supposed to collect a whole lot of golden spatulas. Golden spatulas, eh? SpongeBob, if you could get me back into the chum bucket, I'll give you a bucket full of golden spatulas. In your dreams. You've got a deal. What are you waiting for, SpongeBob? Show those robots who's boss! Me! Alright. There's a lot of menial things. I just like collecting stuff. Just really cool, but nonetheless, I still like it. It's... Ooh. But yeah, like my brother, he played for me. The music is a little over There we go. Okay. Yeah, hey, like SpongeBob! Uh, oh. I just dropped by to give you a bubble hand. Yeah, well, bubble you buddy. You see, you're going to need to learn some new bubble blowing moves if you're going to journey to the ninth dimension and defeat the giant monkey man. What? But uh, all I need to do is figure out how to get rid of these robots. Oh, yeah. Sorry, I've been in the soap bottle a little too long. Uh, where were we? Uh, something about new bubble moves. Right! Press this button, and you'll launch yourself straight up in the air with bubble power that defeats anything that is directly above you! Try it out! Okay. Don't forget to defeat robots or... It shines. Oh, I guess I'm not getting that one. Alright, well, I'm not getting that one. Oh, fully. I can't go through there. <laughs> You need 15 gold to enter this. Okay. But yeah, Wait, what is this? To enter Goo Lagoon? Yeah, like uh, my brother, he had the SpongeBob movie game. And it's pretty much the same as this game. It's like same mechanics, same movements. It's just based on the movie. And it was pretty fun, but I think this game is a lot better because it's a little more original. Oh, shit. Well, it's just like a completely different take. It's just like, the story is more original. And everything in the SpongeBob movie was just like, based on... Okay, well, I'm not getting that again. Hey, Patrick. Nice talk. Yeah, everything in the game was just like, pretty much just like, the boss fights that were pretty much from the movie. And that was fun, but uh, this game, it seems more interesting, you know. I really like games that have, like, original stories. But, you know, it doesn't hurt when you play a game based on the movie as well. What sock? The one you're standing on. Oh, that one. It's lost. Well, if that one's lost, where are your other socks? Well, they're more lost. A bunch of robots came through here and stole my whole sock collection. I could use some help getting them back. Sure thing, Patrick. What are best friends for? Okay, then. For every ten socks you bring back to me, I'll give you a golden turkey baster. You mean spatula? Bless you. Boy, Patrick will be glad to have this back. What? To enter Patrick's rock? We could actually enter that? Cool. It's 
talk to Mr. Krabs. SpongeBob, this flapping robot crisis is Wait, making what? the Krusty Krab lose money like a sinking ship. No money means no more Krusty Krab. No more Krusty Krab means no more fry cooking for you. No more fry cooking? But because you're gullible, I'm gonna help you out. And of course make a small profit in return. I've got a few golden spatulas that I'll be willing to trade to you for some of those shiny objects. You will? Of course. What are employers for? Besides, them shiny objects is worth lots of money. Your treasure chest's looking a bit light, boy. Do you think I've got bilge water on the brain? I ain't running a charity here. Come back when you've got enough shiny objects to trade. Oh, okay. That is not Clancy Brown. That is not the voice of Mr. Krabs. Somewhat disappointed, but I hope in the remaster, they'll get Clancy Brown to actually voice it. I mean, they have to. Okay. All right, let's... I think we just gotta enter Squidward's house and that's it. First, those stupid robots ruined a perfectly relaxing mud bath this morning. And now you show up. Can my day get any more dreary? I am so sorry, Squidward. Patrick and I were just playing a game and... Oh, I correct myself. I should have known that whole robot problem involved both of you. Squidward, I don't know what to do. How can I fix everything? Why don't you move to another town? That should help out more than enough. <laughs> move to another town. <laughs> I cracked me up. <laughs> but seriously, just jump around like an idiot. That should at least make me smile. <laughs> You're in my light. <laughs> just destroy his shit. Hey! Oh, we can even... <laughs> oh really that <laughs> destroying it completely demolishing his house gets us a gold okay 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 just stop jumping will you if you take this golden spatula will you please go away no see squidward i knew that you could help me out you're the best mm. don't touch me Squidward, are you okay? No, I'm not okay, you barnacle head. Do I look like I'm okay? Well, your nose does look pretty big. I mean, bigger than usual because it's usually pretty big. And you look clammy. And oh my gosh, you're bald! I've always been bald, but now I'm stung all over. Well, according to the Jellyfisher Field Manual, severe jellyfish stings can be treated effectively by applying a thick layer of King Jellyfish Jelly to the affected areas. <laughs> King j j Jellyfish! Well, I guess you're off to scale Spork Mountain and die a horrible death under the vicious tentacles of King Jellyfish. <laughs> I'll stay here, balled up here in excruciating pain. You do that! Don't worry, Squidward! I'll bring back that King Jellyfish jelly for you to rub all over yourself. Ow, oh, so ow, oh, did you ow, oh, find the ow, oh, King Jelly, ow, oh, fish, yet, yeah, ow. Oh. <laughs> All right. This is actually the level where they start off with the demo for the rehydrated version. So, I feel like if I just beat this level, I'll end it here, just to get a good taste of it. This is goo. SpongeBob and Cat can't swim, so don't let them fall in the goo. 
This is a teleport box. When you have both the teleport boxes in the arena open, you may teleport between them and jump it inside. Oh, I remember that actually. You may, once both boxes have been opened up. I remember that in the SpongeBob movie game. What is this? We can't jellyfish today. I'm going fishing for robots. Just my size. Oh, shit. I feel oh. like a new sponge. <laughs> I feel still get hurt. Okay. Wait, what did it say? Sponge one may what? Damn it! Okay, he doesn't lose his health when he touches that. Okay, that's good. Good to know. That show! Sorry. <laughs> God damn it, what the fuck? I need to dust my room. I just haven't had the chance because I've been at school all day. Like, literally just go there in the morning. Wait, what is this? Can I- Oh! Okay, I can't get that. Okay, there we go. What is this for? You want to feed the guy to, to complete the bridge? Yeah, why not? What? Alright, that was a little irrelevant, but okay. Well, yeah, I don't know how I'm gonna get down there, but we'll find out. We'll find out in a bit. I have grown up intuition, I should be able to figure it out. Turn to his soccer. Okay, I don't know how I'm gonna. Okay, let's find out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> to reset, which is pretty helpful. Okay. Alright, well, I don't know how I'm gonna get... I honestly don't know how I'm gonna get that, but I'll just leave it alone for now. I don't know if we have to come back and upgrade ourselves. Oh, there's a chum bucket over there. Uh. This is a checkpoint. If you are defeated after activating, you will restart at the checkpoint. Instead of the beginning of the area. Cool. Oh, shit. You know, there's actually another Spongebob game that I played instead of this one. It was, um, Spongebob Revenge of the Flying Dutchman. That game was, it was fun, but it kept crashing so many times, I remember being really annoyed by that. And it only happened when you would, like, switch levels. Like, you know, you enter, like, a certain part of the town, and it would just completely crash on you, which was annoying. I remember I would play with my brother, and, you know, whenever we entered a new level, it would turn black, and I think bubbles would form, and then we'd just like cross our fingers, we'd hold our breaths like, Oh god, is it gonna freeze? And sometimes it froze, but other times it didn't. Okay. 
I don't think I could jump up there. I, I, I don't know. Or maybe there's like some secret maybe that I don't know. Oh, look at that. Still, I don't know how to get that water rat, whatever the hell. Hey, Gary, what's shaking? Wow! No, oh, what do you know? Wow! A bungee jump for a golden spatula! I must be in heaven. Okay, well that answers that. Meow? No, Gary, I still haven't bungee down and gotten that golden spatula. All right, now it's this is a bungee hook. SpongeBob can bungee from it. Bun, just jump up and touch it. Did I press the X button? Did I exit the bungee? Press up. Okay, cool. Oh, I'm really, I'm actually excited of how the rematch is going to do. I know they're going to include a lot of things. Ow, you said it, Gary. Yeah, they're going to include a lot of other things. Like, I think another boss fight that they didn't include in this game. Like a Squidward boss fight. I know there's bosses. I see them all. Because I didn't think I would play this game. And then I was like, well, here we are. But I know that they're going to add an initial Squidward fight. It should be pretty interesting. And hopefully, like I said, they'll get Clancy Brown to reprise his role as Mr. Krabs. Ooh. Okay, how... How are we gonna fight this guy? Spawn so, maybe by pressing the square button. Alright. Is that what we have to do with this guy? Right. Oh, mermaid man! I have all your comics and toys and mail! Huh? W what? Oh, yeah, it's that sponge kid. Okay, that is uh, not... No, what was I supposed to tell you? That's not the voice. <laughs> that Patrick is surrounded by robots and needs my help. Huh? Oh, no. I think it had something to do with massaging my feet. Well, if massaging your feet will save Patrick, then massage I must. Help! They're making me hit myself! Massaging your feet isn't working. I think I'd better try a more direct approach. By clipping my toenails? Here I come, Patrick! Here call? I come, Patrick! Here I... <laughs> Here I come, Patrick! Here I come, Patrick! Okay, no more. Press the L button to read. This is a slide. When SpongeBob, Patrick, and John was on the side, they will zip down the soap at high dramatic speeds. All right, let's get to it. Oh, he's using, he's using it his tongue. Shines. That was a ton of fun. I should do it again sometime. Nice. 
Oh wait, that was something that I missed. Hold on. Nice, alright. Let's try that again. There we go, that's what I missed, but it didn't really matter. Oh god! Alright. How would I have gotten into that? Alright, let's try that one more time. If I don't get it, then boy. There we go. Hey, what's going on? Oh, I got to beat those things. Okay, no problem. Easy peasy. I got this. This is I That thing does nothing. Hammer. I get it. Just my side. I don't know what that does. Okay, what is this? Tar tar. <sighs> is the most satisfying. Push, 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 push. Alright. Cool. Hey, SpongeBob! Woo! Thank goodness you're safe, Patrick. Well, of course, SpongeBob. Why wouldn't I be? Well, the robots and the... Oh, yeah, I found this for you. I don't know what it is, but it looks important. Thanks, Patrick. I tell you what, all that running around has left me pooped. Why don't you continue on for a bit? Okay. Okay, cool. All right, we're going to play oh. oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Okay, hurry up. This is a throw for pack a pit to throw a throw for push buttons, destroy cheekies, or damage the user quickly because throw for wilts after a few seconds. Ooh, up we go! Does it really wilt? Magic can all pick up and throw teas, but only teas that don't have other teas stacked on top of them. That sounds fair. Who is that guy? There is a bus stop you may switch between planes or at bus stops. Who is this guy? It steps, then and then throw it at, but he better hurry before it wilts. Who is this guy? do with that thing up there. I don't think we have the upgrades to reach it yet, so I will just leave it alone. Oh, okay. Um, this is a special teeter totter that only Patrick uses. Have Patrick pick up the fruit, stand on the fruit star dish, and we'll be falling across the other side. Alright, well, let's see that fits. Got you. And I guess the jellyfish don't really do anything. Oh, God! I'm tired, but I'm hungry. 
Oh, so I just had a little can of beer, so I don't know if I want to eat. I don't know if that's a good idea. But I'm actually really hungry. I'm thinking of making myself some soup. I don't so know if that's... Shiny. I don't know if that's a good idea. This is a fun... When Patrick turns, it will begin to storm and it will go boom. Don't be near it when it goes boom. Oh, oh shit, he was not kidding. Can we get ice cream now? Patrick can pick up it and throw it just like it, but he had better throw it fast. Well, I destroyed the team, so I don't think it's... Oh shit, what the fuck? Hey, you barnacle head! Watch where you're going! The rock is talking to me. Oh, mighty rock! I am at your command! Down here, you big pink lummox! Oh, hi there, Mr. Plankton. Are you going to vaporize me today? So very tempting. Unfortunately, I found myself in the undesirable position of having to assist you. I was in an undesirable position yesterday, and now my neck hurts. Heed my words, my large future minion. Go into Jellyfish Cave. Follow the instructions on the signs that you see. At the end of the caves, you'll still be a big pink idiot, but you'll know enough to help defeat the robots and get me back into the chum bucket. Well, then will you vaporize me? I might spare your life so I can force you to work in my sweatshop, making low-quality design and knockoff wallets. Oh, thank you! Now into the caves before all this being helpful gives me a headache. No, we're not. Ah, oh, we jump on this. Uh, uh, yeah, I know. Oh, man. I mean, I'm I'm having fun. I like it, but I just want to. I just want to get to the boss fight so I can stop the video. Scary dark cave. What am I looking at? Oh shit. Can I pick this up? Oh yeah. Well, obviously I can't pick that up. Remember, Patrick and that. Okay. I don't know how to get over there. Where is a whistle? Oh! Oh shit! All right, hold on, hold on. I don't know what to do. I don't think I need it. Ouch! Shit! Oh! Man, I felt that that means it Ouch! Oh fuck! I didn't even know! Oh no! Where am I? I didn't think they took pity on me on that. Like, we made it easier for you. Yeah, right. Don't take pity on me. Ah, oh, 
damn it. No, I'm trying to get that one in the middle. There we go. The weight of the bow all sides of the pressure plates. Okay. What is this? Hatta can also draw and throw to get higher places. He may stack through as well as throwing until another throw. This will allow him to get to even higher places. Oh, that's quite a mouthful. That's pretty cool. Have you been lonely out there all alone? Bubble Buddy! Gosh, everyone is trying to help out today! Step quietly there. That King Jellyfish is just up at the top of this path. Good luck! You'll need it. Okay, we're Thanks, finally Bubble at Buddy. King Jellyfish. Are you sure that you're ready to tackle King Jellyfish? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Okay, there we go. Finally, we can put it into this video. I'm getting tired. I knew the King Jellyfish was big, but who knew he had such a beautiful voice? Don't really do anything. Guard the King John, return to Squidward for your reward. Oh, we're gonna slide. Alright, let's go to Squidward, and then I can get some slides. Oh boy. <laughs> okay, that was a bad idea. Oh man, I missed it. God damn it. Use this to go to Jellyfish Rock. Oh god. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, that feels so much better. Anything for my best friend Squidward. Can I rub some on? Um. What if I just gave you this? Okay, cool. Alright, that means I get to stop. 
Oh, I got one more. Oh, I know where that's from, actually. Anyways, I'm gonna stop right here. I'm starting to get tired. I want soup, but it's it's 127. I think it's too late for soup. Anyways, eh, oh well. It's not every day. Anyways, thank you guys again for watching. Leave a like, comment if you're new, subscribe, and I'll upload this video soon. I gotta take a nap. Bye, guys. See you around.